Well, I've got a small fixture here that I'm going to be measuring today in the lab, but um, my CAD model here has a little extra stuff in it. I've actually got the part in this fixture, and uh, the clients dropped off the fixture, but no part, because we're just checking the fixture. So what I wanted to show you guys today was how, uh, how we can delete parts of the CAD by using what's known as an island. In this case, it's the part. But say you've got another fixture that might have a cap over the sphere, like a tooling sphere. That would be considered an island as well. Or maybe some clamps or some cylinders or something in the, in the fixture or in a part that you didn't want to check. And it's just weighing down your, your um, CAD model. So it's very easy to do. So what I've got is a part here that is going to be plasma cut. And the client just wanted a go no go gauge just to check those whole locations. So, yeah, that looks like a sweet little analysis. So we can measure up that that uh, fixture really well. But I don't want to measure the part. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete the part. So I'm going to hit the space bar. Space bar. Notice my cursor turns into the selection key now. Space bar again. And then what I do is I just cursor over the area that I want to delete out. Okay, so I'm just going to cursor here. Now if you hit the shift control key at the same time, shift control in my in my keyboard they're both down and then I hit the left mouse key. Okay, then I let go of the shift and the control and look what's up here. I've got these selections and I've got select island right here. When I click on that, notice what highlights anything that's connected to this island or this part will highlight for me. So that's perfect. That's the only thing I want to delete out. So I'm just going to hit my delete key now. And just like that, I'll hit the, the space bar again to put my cursor back. The part is gone. Okay, how sweet is that? Just a couple clicks and you are out of that that uh, part that you don't need in your model. So super simple to do. Again, all you're doing is you're hitting your space bar and then at the same time you're pushing both control and shift and then clicking on the mouse key okay that's what shows up this little dialog here selection of the island is what you would do to get rid of that part super simple so go ahead and try that on your system as well mm -hmm. 